hello again guys quick video for you today and what we're going to discuss is dieting more specifically flexible dieting so as we know there are many studies out there that confuse people a lot of different wives tales and gyms and things that confuse you about how to lose body fat okay so it's still the same as it always has been and the only way you can lose body fat is um, by being in a calorie deficit which means eating less food than your body needs to support itself or doing more exercise than you're actually consuming in food okay so you hear a lot of people say oh yeah I did this diet I um, all I did, I just cut carbs out, or I just stopped eating fat, or, you know, I ate as much fat as I wanted, but um, as long as I had, like, 200 grams of chicken every day, I lost weight, or, um, oh, I, I had um, two days where I only ate 500 calories, and the rest of the week, you know, I ate like a pig, or, you know, some, some fads like this, or, you know, I ate all these pills and drinks, and, and blah 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 yeah whatever there might be loads of different ways of losing fat and changing your body composition and there are and there are lots of ways to skin a cat as they say however the reason why people lost fat on those diets were because they were consuming less calories than the body needed so they might have just cut carbs out of the diet and they might have eaten loads of protein and loads of fat every single day and they might think oh yeah I'm eating loads here but the only reason why they've lost fat is because they've cut the carbs out which contain calories which then took them into a, a calorie deficit now the best way to do it is to actually track things spot on so to track your macronutrients which are your, your proteins your fats and your carbohydrates and to figure out what your body needs exactly and to go into a small calorie deficit so that you're slowly losing weight without cutting all carbs out straight away for example which means when you've got no carbs left then what what do you do when that starts to slow down the body fat start starts to come off a lot slower where do you go then well you you've not you're already not eating any carbs so you you've not really got anywhere to go with that so the best way to do it is in um, small steps really so that you've got a long way to go but initially you probably want to make sure you're eating enough and um, so that, that you've, you've got a decent strong starting point okay so this is how I lost uh, my weight I lost over four stone the other year um and initially i wasn't going to the gym at all it was solely on being in a calorie deficit okay um and then i put weight back on muscle weight and some fat when i was bulky and then this year for my bodybuilding prep i lost three stone to get onto stage for my competitions okay so that's flexible dieting if you've got any any questions on it just uh just let me know and um and i'll get back to you cheers guys bye